Hey, how's everybody doing today? Gonna play some Tomb Raider for the first time. I've had this game for a while, but um, I remember not liking it 
a lot as a kid. Just the controls were ass. And it was really challenging. And also, there wasn't any monsters. It was always like bats and shit. So, I don't know. It wasn't one that I played too often. So, here I am. Fucking 20 years later. Finally get to, uh... See what it's like to play Tomb Raider. And, uh... Yeah, of course, drinking beer, so... Titties and beer! Let's fucking go! Get my dad pit around here somewhere. It's probably in my fucking robes. What's a man gotta do to get that kind of attention from you? It's hard to say exactly, but you seem to be doing fine. Well, great. Though truth is, it ain't me that wants you. Oh? No, Miss Jacqueline Natla does. From Natla Technologies. You know, creator of all things bright and beautiful. <laughs> Seal it, Larson. Ma'am. Feast your eyes on this, Lara. How does that make your wallet rumble? I'm sorry. I only play for sport. Then you'll like a big park. Peru. Vast mountain ranges to cover. Sheer walls of ice, rocky crags, savage winds, and there's this little trinket. An age-old artifact of mystical power is buried in the unfound tomb of Qualapec. That's my interest. Mm -hmm. You could leave tomorrow. Are you busy tomorrow? Did she just say Qualapec? <laughs> I'll go to Koala Pack. I don't even care. That sounds fun. <laughs> okay. I swear I have to. Whatever. Formatted memory card with at least one free block? Is this implying that I don't have a free block? This is interesting. Controls, okay. Step left and right. Look left. Oh, well, just look. Okay. Huh. Well... Can I change this? Oh, shit. I see, I see. Oh, hi, kitty cat. How you doing? How funny. She wasn't here for, like, a while. Sorry. Go into your little clubhouse. Hey, look. You put your little clubhouse. She wasn't here the whole time I was setting up. Oh. Look, walk, jump. Jump action. I don't know. I guess, uh... I'll start with the default. I thought this was going to be a little different. I thought I was going to be able to really customize it. Oh. That's actually decent, cause... Hey! Get out of here! Get out of here! Hey! Stop it! Oh no. Uh, she's getting my foot. <laughs> I'd rather get my foot than my PlayStation cord. Uh... Okay, so that, yeah, that was me selecting a, a block then, right? 
Uh, I should, probably should have gone to Laura's house. I think that's like the, the training level. Whatever. <laughs> oh, God. Did she know? Oh shit. That's why she brought this guy. To get eaten by the robot wolf dog things. Oh, they're just regular wolves. Okay. They're not robots. <laughs> this infinite ammo fucking machine pistols. <laughs> yeah. Hey. Hey. Oh, fuck you up. Oh, fuck you up. She gets vicious. My arms are covered in little kitten scratches. She tried to bite a chunk out of my thumb on accident. That one she wasn't being mean. She really she thought it was funny. That was partially my bad. Oh, so this is okay. Oh, this is gonna be Did I just turn around? Oh I like that. That's cool. Jump back. Okay. Walk. Look kind of Spyro style. Okay. That's... Oh, jeez. Okay. Oh, I guess I could have jumped. Let's jump. Oh, that's roll. Whoops. There's a jump, right? Okay, yeah, there we go. There's gotta be a jump. This is essentially a puzzle platform. Oh. Thank you, snappy camera. Okay. Let's try that with some forward momentum. What am I to jump roll? These controls are. See, you can see now why I I, I struggled with this. I've I've played platformers before, like. Uh, with Can you not, I'm sorry, can you not fucking run and jump at the same time? Okay, what the fuck then? Oh my god. Oops. Can I change? No. Okay, inventory. That's cool. But I can't get into the menu like this. Oh fuck. Woo, this game's hard. <laughs> Is there... Okay. Sure. Why the fuck not? How does that sound? Ah! Oh, 
Okay. I feel like I could have handled that a little bit better. Just kind of like button mash this shit. Uh, find the buttons! Find the buttons! Oh, the kitty's watching. Can't believe this cat watches TV. God damn. Okay. Tomorrow's the day. According to the tracking information, tomorrow's the day. I get my analog controller. Or, not analog. Is that what they call it? I don't know. The one with the fucking sticks. Ooh. This is cool, though. I, I actually, I can kind of get into this. This is, like, explorative and stuff. Wow. Ooh, I feel like that was lucky. I did not know I was going to... <laughs> was that the sliding sound effect being delayed? Oh. Oh, what? Oh, God damn it, turn the camera. What is that, this button? Huh. Okay, that's cool. That's ominous. Oops. Okay, I guess... I guess that's it, huh? <laughs> Are you gonna get her? Are you gonna get her? She's, like, so interested in this. Okay, I'm grabbing my beer before she knocks that over. Everything else up there is, like, pretty much inconsequential. Oh, can I pick up Those aren't interactable. This one's like, oh, whoops. I kind of wish I could do a different control scheme. So, can I jump? Oh, yeah, okay, cool. Interesting. Okay. Honestly, so far, I'm kind of digging this. It's kind of giving me, like, like, uh, very simplified, like, Metroid Prime kind of vibes. I don't know what kind of puzzles I'm going to encounter. Ooh, what is this? Oh. Bridge? Okay. Um. I, oh. I, I do like how precise the movement is. It's oh whoops, this one's it's almost like um, like it's on a grid, and I feel like in modern games that would be very annoying, but in a game like this with such weird like tank controls, this actually doesn't really hurt the game. I feel like it kind of helps it. So I'm gonna come back to this. It looks like if I jump down there, I don't think I'll be able to get back up. And as cool as that looks to explore, I have this other path over here that goes up. I kind of want to check that out. And this one, it looks like I can always just drop up. Wow. Okay. That's cool that you just walk right up those. I thought I was going to have to jump.
Okay, I may have been looking at that wrong. Or, no, I don't know. Graphics are a little difficult to discern. Is it the, oh, it's not the beer, it's the cord you're staring at. Duh. I was supposed to be grocery shopping today, but with this whole COVID scare thing, I was like, you know what? Do some dishes and stream. I didn't really know what I wanted to play, but I kind of wanted to play something new. And a video popped up on my recommended while I was getting high this morning. <laughs> Body check the wall right quick. Oh, what the fuck is that? Okay. Well, doesn't seem hostile. But yeah, a video came on this morning. I can't, I can't remember who it was by, but um, it's a really cool channel. They do a series called Impossible Ports, and I don't know. I'm, I'm a fucking video game nerd. I like that shit. But this was a a a Tomb Raider port. For the fucking Game Boy Advance, if you can believe that, of all things. And looking at, at the person played on the Game Boy Advance in the video, I was like, well, damn, I know it's gonna look way better on my PlayStation. What the fuck is that? Is that a power up? Are there power ups in this? Oh! Oh, fuck! Woo-hoo-hoo! God damn! Okay, uh, look down before you jump. Why am I trying to loot this fucking bear? Bury the bones for prayer experience. Better be a damn health pack around here somewhere. And I guess I don't have to tap X to shoot, I should just hold it. Secret door, okay. Oh, sticky. Okay, I feel safe putting that up there now. I don't think she's gonna make a jump for it. No, you're gonna be good. So, now, I guess I figure out how to get back up on those bridges. At least. See, this was the smart way to do it. You take care of the mobs before you jump down there. That's what I should have done with the bear. And I don't know if I took that damage from the jump or from the bear. But god damn, that hurt. Oh, okay, I see what's going on. I was like, uh, continue moving. Nope, this is PlayStation graphics. Okay. Oh, I still have guns out. Whoops. Sideways jump? No, how did a... F 
How did I fucking do that? Okay. So it's not direction and then jump, it's it's jump and then direction. What was that lag though? Fuck off with the lag, please. Actually, I want to go see what that weird little, that, like, idol or something was. I think that was over here. Yeah. Fuck is that? Is that ground? Yeah, okay. That's not a pit. That's all I need to know. What the hell? There's no interacting with this? Okay. And I don't even need to jump to do that? That's tight. So, oh, okay, so I guess that just marks the get the fuck back up point. That's handy, I guess. Oh my god, I really want to change the control scheme. Also, how does saving work in this? Do I... Compass. Oh, damn. Okay. And then... The Pistolas. Okay. Um... Hmm. I hope, too, at some point I get, like, a map? And, like, I don't know if I should be looking for ink ribbons, or what the fuck. But a way to save would be rather neat. And... Okay, can I... There's a, there's a forward jump. That's a backwards jump. Is that the same as that? No, I think the former is faster. Oh! Okay. So, to answer that question, the bear did the majority of the damage there. I will say this is a much slower paced game than I was kind of expecting. Ooh. Is that a med pack? Oh my god. Pick it up? Do I have to... Do I step on it to pick it up? Oh my god. Wait. <laughs> pick it up! What the hell is the matter with you? Oh, this is fucking hilarious. Okay, um, whatever, fuck you then. I don't like how certain things have certain draw distances, that, that makes it kind of creepy. Oh yeah, tread, tread that. Okay, whatever, fuck you. Sometimes squares jump, sometimes X's jump. Combined with tank movement controls. And I don't know how to pick items up. <laughs> Which you would think is the action button. But that didn't do anything. Like a little corner like that shouldn't be so hard to maneuver around. Okay, so practice. I need to do one of these, and then also action to fucking grab onto the thing. Oh, shit. I'm trying to do the camera like it's fucking Spyro. See, I should have just chose the control scheme that had 
camera on triangle. Oh, okay. I really need to pick up that. What I can only imagine is a health pack. Jesus! Okay, so... Use walk. So it seems like run... moves you... Let's just say two movement values... per tick, and walk moves you one movement value per tick, it seems. So you can use walk to get to more... precise locations on the grid, it seems. That's... Good to know. Damn. <laughs> PlayStation developers were thirsty sending this shit. Oh, hold it. Okay, I think I need to do a running jump. I feel like that's got a greater distance than a standing jump. But the button timing in this is just so odd. It's... I don't know, it doesn't feel like a normal platformer, you know? It feels weird. And... I hit the button! What the fuck? Okay, I guess press and hold the button? God damn. Ah! Uh. That doesn't respawn, does it? This is long before video games were forgiving. Okay, yeah, you can't do a, a quick tap, I guess. This game isn't about... Let's... Thank you. Like, what the hell's going on here? I really want to know what that damn power-up is! The running into walls mechanic is kind of funny. Not a lot of platformers have something like that. I mean, Spyro does, but only if you're charging. But, like, nothing in Crash. Nothing in, like, any of the cool PS1 platformers. Okay. Line it up. And charge. Fuck yeah! Ah. Uh, okay, so, that's fucked. Give me one moment. While I apparently restart my PlayStation. I don't know what to do with this damn game right now. Uh. The GameCube holds the uh, the PlayStation top down because uh, my open button is fucked. Oh, oops. Yep, that's one full memory card, if you ask me. Let's see what we got. Spyro, Crash 2. Um, 
lot of Final Fantasy VII saves. So... Like, I can get rid of Ripto's Rage, but I'm just going to end up putting another one back on there. Um, honestly, yeah, let's, they're full, I think that was my full last file, I had beaten all the weapons and everything, but, uh, it wasn't on stream, so it doesn't count. I'm just going to delete all of these old Final Fantasies. I don't even have tactics anymore. I was borrowing that from a friend a long ass time ago. I don't know where any of these sevens are at. These other ones look 50 hours into a tactics game. This, I have no idea. Let's get rid of that. Okay. I wish I could move them. Can I move them? No! Don't delete that. Yeah, I just wanted to move them. I don't like how it's, um, you know, I just want to flip those two on the end. That bothers me, but, uh, uh, no, we're done here. I'll, I'll get over it. I'll just go ahead and set that back down up there. So, I guess that's why it warned me in the beginning. It was it was trying to tell me, like, hey, your memory card's full, homie. That's okay. Um, a, I didn't get very far. B, uh, that was not, in fact, a cool power-up. It was just a save crystal. Which I suppose is sort of a power-up in its own right. Be. <laughs> just sliding into the fellow for it. Bye! <laughs> Come on, let's, let's get this way. Now you're good. It's the memory foam. She's always gonna. She's got like no weight into the memory foam, so she's always gonna sink one way or another. And that way dips off of the memory foam into a. Just a pile of pillows. Yeah, okay, see, no memory card warning. Look at that. Fucking... Wowee. Okay, look. That one's got look... on triangle. I like. Jumps in the same spot, actions in the same spot, which I've kind of started getting used to. Steps are the same. Kind of like that one. Yeah, we're gonna go with this one. And, furthermore, additionally, we're going home. I just wanna see what this whole. Fucking rich bitch gets to just travel around the world and do cool shit. Welcome to That's my British house. imperialism Welcome to my at its finest. Had a beef roast cooking since last night. I'm gonna make up some egg noodles and have like a like a stroganoff type thing going on.
Use the D-pad to go into the music room. All those random art assets that they totally did not need to make. Is this the music room? Or is this a fucking pool? Ooh. Okay, let's do some tumbling. Press the jump button. Now press it again. That's and a fucking press one impressive. Of the directions and I'll jump that way. There we go. See, I actually needed this. Oh, that's it, yeah. Can I play the piano? I thought you were a professional. Let's find out what's through door number one. Ah, uh, the main hall. Sorry about the crates. I'm having some things put into storage and the delivery people haven't been yet. Is that your excuse? I don't believe you. I feel like you just did this for fun. Run up to a crate, and while still pressing forward, press action, and I'll vault up onto it. Call that a vault? Wait, is it? I'm not gonna do this. Okay. Ah. Okay, so... Ooh. Pressing X... Oops. Uh, I must not be able to go that way. Yeah, pressing X mid-jump, she like... sticks her hands out to try and catch a ledge. That's good to know. This is goddamn annoying, though. I don't even know if this will be better with the, uh, the analog stick. We'll find out, I guess. Are there even power-ups in this game? Okay, can't open doors. Cross that off of our list of... Uh... Don't glitch! Equip the armor. <laughs> so you can't be right next to a barrier and jump, I guess. It's a little annoying, but I kind of understand. So, I guess the way to go is this way. Okay. Is there really no duck button? I need a duck button. This used to be the ballroom, but I've converted it into my own personal gym. What do you think? Well, let's... I don't... With the walk button down, I won't fall off even if you try to make me. Go on. Try it. Fuck. Is this one? Okay. That's cool. That's actually really good to know. That's another... Uh... Cool mechanic. If you want to look around... Press and hold the look button, then press in the direction you want to look. Uh, jump forward. Okay, I think I'm kind of getting this down. 
If a jump is too far for me, I can grab the ledge and save myself from a nasty fall. Walk to the edge with the white line until I won't go any further. Then press jump immediately, followed by forward, and while I'm in the air, press and hold the action button. Easy for you to say. Let's try this again. Around the edge. Jump forward. Press forward. Alright, that was actually pretty easy. This is number three, so over here. Okay. Practice those jump If I do combos. a running jump, walk to the edge with the white line until I stop. Then let go of walk and tap backwards to give me a run up. Press forward and almost immediately press and hold the jump button. I won't actually jump until the last minute. Yeah, why though? Why don't you jump when I fucking press the button like a normal game would do? That's so weird. Okay, whatever though. I'm glad I know how to do this now. See, that would have made getting that thing way easier. Oh, it didn't work that time. Right, oh, this I didn't is a do really big one. So do what? a running jump exactly as before, except while I'm in the air, press and hold the action button to make me grab the ledge. Okay, we got this. Nice. Oh, <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> oh shit, that's stupid, whatever. So that's the, I guess that's the mount. You, you stay on the, like, the outside edge of the grid. Let's find out what five is. Try to vault up here. I can't climb up because the gap is too small. But press right. And I'll shimmy sideways until there is room. Then press forward. Uh, okay, let's see. Tutorial level good. Tap backwards. I'm gonna be a fucking and pro. I'll jump off this. Immediately press and hold the action button, and I'll grab the ledge on the way down. Okay. Can you go around corners like that? No corners. Okay. Good to know. So I guess this way. So Let's go for a swim. Okay. The jump button and the directions <laughs> move me around underwater. Look at that. That's some liminal ass water, though. Just saying. Oh, okay, so this is like aim. And that's like forward. Okay. I like swim controls. Oh, swim controls I can deal with. Just use forward and, and left down. and right to maneuver around on the surface. Press jump to dive down for another swim about, or go to the edge and press action to climb out. Right. Okay. Now I'd better take off these wet clothes. Like the sound of that. Auga! This game is like 50% fan service. Bear with me, guys. Alright. We'll play the cutscene again. No, actually, the cutscene was very boring. The first one was kind of cool. They had dialogue and shit. That cutscene was uh, pretty lame. Look at this cute little munch in. All day, she's been fucking tearing me up. Or when I was cooking, uh, she was just following me around, bothering me. <laughs> like, hey, pick me up. Pat me. Let me eat your hand. While I'm trying to make a fucking breakfast sandwich. Also, this is, this is a fucking PSA right here. This is me giving back to the community. Walmart... Your local Walmart, even, may still have these. Mine... I'll tell the story in a moment, but... They have these fucking sandwich press things. It's just this little mini griddle 
that fucking presses sandwiches, and they are perfect. Takes a little bit of trial and error to get it right. Let me tell you, the first few sandwiches I was making, I was overloading that bitch and making a huge mess. But uh, I made some breakfast sandwiches this morning. They were fire. King legitimate. Okay. Okay, I got this. Oh. I can't grab it backwards. Huh. What do I do? Can I just, wait, how funny would it be if I could just bolt up? Oh, I was, okay, yep, duh, I was doing it backwards. Okay. God, this camera angle's fucked. I guess that'll do. Haha, <laughs> yeah! That was actually very satisfying. I guess that's the secret area sound. Sick. Let's get used to that. What the fuck? Huh. Uh, apparently, uh, according to the Twitter page, Washington County Scanner, uh, Oregon has a geyser. But then it was a screenshot of, like, Google Maps showing a traffic collision. So I don't know if somebody just, like, fucking hit a fire hydrant or what. But, uh, my griddle story, uh, which is not the name of a new PlayStation game that I'm getting. Oh, shit, I forgot. Fuck you. Uh, so, I went to Walmart during holiday times and saw them but I was buying everybody Christmas presents so I opted not to buy one until I was done with my Christmas purchases unfortunately by the time I had finished my Christmas purchases they had sold out of the beloved sandwich presses, but they instead had a lot of mini griddles, and then this one thing for like making mini bundt cakes, and I was like, nah, nah, but I did buy the mini griddle, I just never used it, I was like, fine, if I have to settle for this, I'll settle for this, and you know, I bet I could press a sandwich in there. What's what, the cops gonna come stop me? No. Um. Oh, okay. So yeah, back to you. Um. While I was uh out shopping for actually oddly enough cat stuff for this little munchkin, I noticed that Walmart did in fact have a couple of sandwich presses. There. Very boring story, I know. Uh, I, I returned the, the griddle, and um, then I got a sandwich press. Moral of the story, um, I returned a griddle and got a sandwich press. 
like I said, it's it's not a very good story. The moral is shit too. But, uh, oh well. The sandwiches are good, so fuck the morals. The sandwiches that thing comes out with, phenomenal. If you can even call it a sandwich, to the I did a couple of grilled cheese. Those were pretty fire. But what I've been really fucking with is these breakfast sandwiches I've been making. However, uh, it's only like bread on one side. I put like a sausage patty. I cook the sausage patty in there. Crack an egg over that shit. Let it cook for a little bit. Uh, throw a little bit of cheese on top of it, and then put a nice piece of buttered bread on the other on, on the final top of it. Close that bitch up. The thing practically cuts everything in half. What the fuck is up with the camera? God damn. Uh, pretty much cuts it in half, seals around the edges, and you just have this delicious, cheesy, eggy, sausagey. Fuck it, the toast is perfect. It's it's phenomenal. The first few times I tried that though, like the first time I did it, I I was like two eggs. I wanted two eggs in there. Uh, and that was way too much egg. Shit started pouring out the side. It's not a good time. Bad experience. Still a good sandwich. Still a really good sandwich. But um uh, pain in the ass to clean up afterwards. So next time, this is the key, uh, I did one egg, but I still, you know, I scrambled it up real nice, and in doing so, uh, introduced a lot of air to the eggs. And, um, if there's anything eggs don't like, it, well, they do like air. It makes them nice and fluffy, actually. I don't like but if it's one thing sandwich presses don't like, it's fluffy eggs. Because that shit expanded so much in there. It was like I put three or four eggs. And made a totally different type of mess. Final revision was one egg, not whipped, not scrambled or anything. I just cracked the egg in there, let it pour out. I broke the yolk, tried to kind of put it equally between the two halves. Perfect. It didn't over expand or nothing. It was literally so good. Oh yeah! And look, this time we can save! <laughs> oh shit. Okay. Um. I only, only get one of those. So if I go do a bunch of stuff, I can't come back to that point and save it? Okay. Yes. I hope they kind of designed around that. Somehow, maybe. Huh? What? Finally, mus the music in this is very scary. So you're like, oh, no music. I'm just going around doing my thing. Now it's like fucking action game music. Is there anything else in here? Am I good?
Alright, never mind. I'm actually really digging the music. It was an ambiance change, but like in a good way. Okay. Was there a time limit to doing that? I, like... It was just very intense music for... What all just transpired. Hmm. Ah! I see! Who oh, is that, actually? Never mind. We have to. Grab another one of them. So, how does that work? Cool. Doesn't seem like it has a max inventory limit. I mean, I'm sure it does. I'm sure it can't count up to infinity, but it doesn't look like it takes up additional slots. That's got to be a secret area, right? Hell yeah, look at that fucking Mayan calendar. That's pretty rad. Also, it's like ominous? I don't know, it's a weird feeling from that. Weird vibe. Spooky. It's, it's a pretty spooky game, I guess. I don't know. We're not like Silent Hill levels or anything. Those make me think of some wicked-ass traps, too. Like, this is a bad place to be right here. Okay. Cool. I had a feeling I was going to be able to clip through that. It's a weird jump, but now that I'm, like, getting used to it, it's not that bad, and I can kind of work with it. I want to see what else is on this area. So, oh, uh, it looks like, yeah, that's the way it came from. Okay, never mind. I think I'm pretty much done here. Oh, stupid. Vault it! Vault it! Oh. Uh, there we go. Wait, do I have items sticking out of my backpack? God damn this camera. Oh, I guess... Oh, fuck. Can I reset that? Oh, that was a good time. I kind of forgot it was timed. Oh, shit. Go, go, go. Oh, shit. Oh, okay. I fucked up. I didn't see that. I now kind of understand the gravity of the situation. We're going to make another attempt at that. Obviously, I think this is the way that I need to go. Okay. So, we're going to fucking turn. Kind of, I think I know what to do. Nope, that was not, that was not it. No matter.
Oh my god. I'm doing the wrong one anyways. I just want to see if this kind of jump is going to be what I need. Okay, that'll be perfect. Ah, uh, I think if I would have hit X, I could have made that. God damn, this is hard, and these, these are the forgiving levels. Like, this is gonna be a tough game to beat. No fucking doubt. Damn it! Why? Whatever. Watching it run around ball like this is making me thirsty. Fuck, not like that. They should have kept the music rolling. Yeah, okay. Whatever. Not enough time to earn enough space to make that jump. There we go. Fuck! That was hard. The only thing that made that difficult though was it it was time based. What the fuck is that? Can I clip the camera and find out? Oh, whatever. This giant troll. Oh, fuck! That's, is that where I need to go? What is going on down there? Ugh, let's check it out, I guess. I forgot what the objective of this game is. Am I supposed to be looking for like a like a lost artifact? Makes sense it would be something like that. If I do this in a very calculated manner, these you know, jumps should be fairly easy, right? Yeah, I don't even need to hold X down for that.
Spooky music! What's this guy? Is that thing going up? That, per that switch seems permanent. Like down there. Okay. Uh, hmm. I guess I'd rather slide down than anything. You know? Let's back up to the top. That must be the door that opened. Oh shit! It's episodic! I finished the first level? Oh, he's squishing your face. <laughs> so cute. This is like, I think that's really adorable. Uh, missed the secret. It must have been in this little last area. Fuck yeah, we'll write that shit, bitch. Let's go. Alright, that wasn't too bad. That wasn't too hard. It's the controls and the mechanics that make the game challenging. I do like the idea of having to, you know... A, a, a jump is a combo of buttons more than, oh shit, the correct timing. You know, Mario, Skull Monkeys, shit like that, it's all about timing as far as your jumps. Timing, whether or not you're running, how much momentum you carry. This is about, you know, executing a quick jump combination of buttons. Which is... Interesting. And I guess I probably don't get a map. Since, like, for instance, I will not be returning to that first area. I thought I would be returning there. Like, this was all kind of like an open world exploration type thing, but... This is the fucking PlayStation 1. Just glad you got good aim. Combat's fairly easy in this. Borderline boring. But I don't think you play this game for the combat. I think you play this game for the the exploration and the it's a very interesting place to explore. Oh, water. What's this? It's a trough. Oh shit! Oh. 
God damn. I do really want to get Resident Evil though. I I I definitely plan on getting that game. Or those games, I should say. I want one, two, and three. The only one that I've actually beat is three. Oh, fuck! Oh my god. Uh... Um... Uh, fuck, this is Subnautica all over again. I'm gonna die. Wow. God damn. Okay. Don't go that way. I still kind of feel like there's probably something tucked away over there. A little, little secret or a hidden thingamajig. You know? But this definitely seems like the way to go. That looks like water surface. Fucking dragons? Wait. Is this nothing? This, okay, um, huh. Okay, I'll surface and then go back to the first way because now I'm definitely feeling like I'm missing something why would this be here if not for something you know Hey, look at that. Okay, never mind. Don't look at that. It's close. Fuck. Fuck. No. Oh my god. Come on. I hope it's not instant death. Holy shit! Damn near! Okay, so... I need to flip a switch or something. That was wild. Okay, which direction did I come from? Fuck. Maybe I should start using the compass. Okay, that's got a key. There's keys in this. Okay. Oh, 
feel like this moves. This platform or this this panel, this wall, big ass wall panel. I didn't notice she had red hair until just now. I don't think they ever had her with red hair in the uh, Angelina Jolie movies. That's insane. Or at least I always remember her with black hair. I don't know. Maybe I'm wrong. Uh, but please don't tell me because... That would be like a microaggression or something, and I just, I don't like being wrong. All signs are kind of pointing to that little pool of water as being the way forward. I really feel like I'm going to fucking drown if I keep playing over there. Maybe there's a switch underwater to open that door instead of a switch above ground? I would say above water, but I feel like the word's technically supposed to be above ground. Whatever. Yeah, also, like, maybe there's little tiny keys that I'm not seeing? No. Oof! Well, fuck you. What the hell is that? Is that the wolf I killed? I think it is. Oops. Can I swing from vines? Is that like... Is that a thing in this? I don't think it is. But I don't fucking know. That's the dog I killed. Okay, well... Yeah, like I said, all signs are kind of pointing to this poodle of water. These two... Oh, that's a... F okay, that's a switch. It's very hard to see the little horizontal part right there. those animal pelts are. She should have brought a team of archaeologists. They could have been figuring that shit out, you know. Okay. Yo!
I don't think shooting that's the way out. Okay. It's a movable block. Oh, bullshit. That's what I get for not holding walk down, I guess. Wait, that's all? How the hell do I get out of here? Can I continue pulling this? If I can continue pulling this, I'll just pull it onto that. That looks like a spot. That's how I do this. The buttons. Okay. I see a path that way. I also foresee a path this way. Oh, that would have tipped a long time ago. Maybe not. Uh, Is that a key? That looks like some crazy, like, Aztec key. Okay. I don't know what that means. I love the 2D sprite rotating in a 3D world. I don't know why, but that's like... It's like a fucking thing, like an aesthetic, you know? That's a key. Right? Yeah, it looks very key-like. Okay, bear with me just a moment. I really gotta use the bathroom. And I may take, like, 
one quick rip off the bong. I'm pretty sure I left some ash in there, so I'm not even going to put up the BRB screen. I will literally be like a minute. I haven't left yet, so I'll start the claw.
I am back. Sorry for the delay. Uh, which ear does this go to? Left ear. My dad played this game a lot when I was a kid, and I told him I was playing it. He kind of was reminiscing a little bit about it. He really liked this game. And I can, I, I can understand that. Wow. I can understand that. Uh, it's pretty fun. Um, I can also definitely see why this wouldn't really appeal to me as, like, a fucking seven-year-old. Like, it's very challenging. It is not easy to get the character to do what you want the character to do. And when you're playing a video game as a kid, that is very important. You know, Mario goes the direction of the fucking button that I press. Shit, so does Crash. This isn't even like a 2D thing. Crash goes the way I, I press. You know, this one was... Odd to me. Wait. Wait! I still don't know what to do. <laughs> God damn it. So, I'm hoping... I guess we'll try this. I guess what I'm going to hope for is that if I jump... Oh. Oh. Never mind. I have to pull that back in. I Well, I still want to try it. I thought maybe if I jumped up on that... Uh... That would be enough weight, and it would just go... And it would break through whatever the fuck that weird root stuff is down there, but... No. Um, and I don't think I can push this. I think I can only pull this. I, I could be wrong on that, but... Okay. Yeah, no. I was wrong on that. I also apparently don't need to hold that down. She just, like, goes through the animation. Which means no half grid space uh, block drops. I like it when she waits. A lot of the times when I get up, obviously, she just, like, leaves. She goes and does whatever the fuck, or maybe she follows me or whatever. But, uh... She's getting to the point where she's, like, she likes staying out here, whether or not I'm in here. Which I think is cool. <laughs> Big stretch, huh? can still feel her ribs and her spine and stuff but in the like first night that I had her she ate a full ass bowl of food and I was giving her bits of turkey and I gave her a little bowl of milk I'll get her healthy in no time she eats real well she plays forever she's vicious too Little fucking monster. Do I need to keep going with this? Nope, I think that's just... That's far enough! Ooh, is that a treasure chest? Ah, oh, fuck you, bat! This game's a lot of button holding instead of pressing, and it just feels weird to me. Doesn't feel right. It's not a treasure chest, it's a fucking chair. God damn it. <laughs> Can't pick that up. I guess, yeah, let's save. Pretty cool how little the fucking oh well 
I don't think I was going to be able to really jump to anything extra. Yeah, that's just, that's kind of like the let out. So, now I want to go find the door that needs the key. Subtle change in the tiles. Ooh, okay. I'm guessing silver key. I realized the red thing I was seeing was my blood when I was going through that corridor. some got fucking unlimited ammo bitches just like in the movies <laughs> that is a badass backflip jump I literally wish I could do that could also have like I don't know if you'd call it an irrational fear but I typically refer to it as an irrational fear. But the, like, I will just fucking break my neck if I try to do that. Like, I will, just, I will break my neck and instantly die. Great. More swimming. Let's save that. like this. Th all the places in here seem very fucking, like, I, I, the only word I can think to describe it is liminal. I don't know about that. Oh! Wish the music would continue. Like, this is a cool track. Good ass ambiance. Like, I'm gonna try just a standard jump. Yeah, that was. <gasps> Damn. I okay. I need to hold. Fucking. What's it called? Hold walk when I do that. Also, my neck is kind of starting to hurt. Scooch over, buddy. There was a cute little chirp. There was a cute little chirp. Just do that very often. <laughs> yeah. 
you fucking funny. Oh, all the way up. You're so pretty. Ah. I will say, playing down here is kind of weird. It like puts everything at an odd axis for me. This takes a little bit of adjustment though. That's why when I'm like getting frustrated in Skull Monkeys, I gotta sit up. I gotta like center myself to the screen better. <gasps> why? Oh my god. See, I, I'm glad they're putting a pool of water here, because, like, in later levels, there will be no pool of water there, and I will just die if I miss that jump. So, you know, that's nice of them. I'm just, I'm, like, holding the button down too long, I'm just running off the fucking edge. To the edge. Jump forward. And that's all. That's all I need to do. And then I'll walk. Yeah. Go that way. So. Let's walk to the corner. Right? Sick. Alright. And I don't know if I can get up there. <gasps> Actually. I'll walk down. What do you think? I th You know, I think I actually can. I think if I... I'm thinking... No run. I just... Oh, maybe not. Look at that. I don't know. Jeez, I don't know. I will try and run. Okay. Go from back here. Go for one of these. Nope. Oh, on the ground too. Yikes. Okay. Well, that that must be where another place where we like come out of maybe. That one's way easier, and I don't know why. It's like at an angle, so I thought it was going to be harder. But um, I guess that just meant that I could jump and not like fall over the edge. Oh, okay. This leads up to the diving board part, it looks like. Oh... I fucking knew it! Bastardo! I, I, I kind of like the strafe button, too. Um, you know, it's like a... It's like a nod to how precise the controls are. Okay, how far is this? That is not a floating platform. They're like stairs. Okay, cool. This isn't going to be that difficult. I thought it was like... You know, I don't know what kind of... I don't know what level of physics we're dealing with here. I don't know if it's like... Semi-realistic. I mean, look at that... Uh, I guess that jump isn't that unrealistic. Shit. Last time I tested, which I think in like high school or whatever, I had like a... Six foot long jump. Ooh. One of these days I'll turn off my mic filter so you can hear her purring away. Ah!
packs, four bed packs. I really hope there's enough of these in this game. <laughs> Cause <laughs> Yeah. See that would have been a uh, that would have been a very annoying maneuver otherwise. Like, if I didn't have that weird little strafe button. Like, it comes in handy more than I expected it would. What the fuck? Hey, what's that? Oh shit, that's rad. So I do get a shotgun. I'm assuming. I just rolled around. <laughs> We're on top of the little temple thing, I think. Don't think I can get over there. Uh, I think. Yeah, I know I can get over here, but I don't think I can get up there. This is some pretty cool carpet that they have, though. Oh, I think. He... It's weird if you if you turn too abruptly, you like break her walking animation. Just why it looks like she's like tripping up the whole time. Okay. That was the first one. This one just opened. Wait, what the fuck? No way. Are you shitting me? Oh, that's annoying as fuck. I have to go all the way around? What the fuck? Oh my god. Dumb. Ah! Momentarily forgot how to swim. Excuse me, I fucking had walk held down. Hey, you, you're not good enough yet at jumping from platform to platform. Keep replaying this time. This time. Oh, shit. Actually, that's that was the wrong button. This time. That time? I don't fucking know. I will say the sounds in this are very weird. Like, none of this sounds authentic at all. The footsteps are off. The water sounds are odd. It, it, it feels like a dream. You know what I mean? The familiar, but yet also at the same time vague architecture and art also kind of lent themselves to that. Oh. 
That's the... Okay, this is roll. Okay, I just wanted to remember what button roll was. I need to start using roll in combat more. That's so fucked. Oh my god, I hate that. I hate everything about that. Okay, I just want to get my heading real quick. What was that? Are you okay? Yeah? Were you just kicking me to get my attention because you wanted pets? You're fucking weird. You're a weirdo, dude. Okay, so I just need to like, bam, 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 go right down, basically. Okay, how can I resist this fuzzy little baby? This fuzzy little baby. Go, 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 go. Come on, we fucking got this. Oh my god, go, go, go! <laughs> How shitty would it have been if that just like, right there, right as I like, into the wall. Also, is this where Minecraft got that sound? The world may never know. Who the hell? Oh shit, son of a bitch. Those don't respawn, do they? jump, and then do a jump grab. So, run, jump, jump, uh, I actually think I can fucking make it with it just the run, jump, grab. I don't even think I need those platforms. I mean, it, it would make a lot more sense if I didn't need those platforms, right? I'm about ready for some of that fucking roast. Hell yes. Oh! Ah, uh, okay. Don't let go of X. There we go. Oh. 
Oh, shit! Just my fucking luck. Well, I mean, that wasn't even luck. That was literally just being stupid. Those blocks are a fucking death trap. Very annoying. <gasps> God! Okay, I just need to hold walk the whole time when I'm up there. Fuck. God damn it. be the fucking golden age of this stream. <laughs> like, these tight areas are very annoying to do, because... The camera just does not work with you here. Okay. Let's look around. So, yep, kind of what I was expecting. We're looking at a bam, bam, bam type situation. Which doesn't look all that hard. As long as I don't overshoot blocks and, you know, fall off the other side. But it looks like this one goes straight into the corner. So that's easy. <gasps> so that's easy. Why did I even step backwards? God, this, this takes an annoying amount of diligence for a platformer. Like, Skull Monkeys is difficult, but I would say in a very different way. It's a very different style of difficulty. This, if I accidentally hit the direction button without... Oops. Without uh, the right button held down, I can very easily just fucking die. Oops. And yet again, uh, it ends on a corner jump, which is arguably easier than the jump that I just did. Hey, f you! Trying to make me panic up here?
Do they just like wait to give her the rabies vaccine until she gets back, or is that like part of the health kit? You know what that's gonna do, right? That's gonna fucking open the other one, but also put it on a timer. And this is probably the pedestal, or not pedestal, but like cliff that I saw from the other side that has the save crystal. Nice. Okay. Neat. So, yeah, I guess we'll use that. Big stretch. Oh, whoops. This isn't a Final Fantasy game. Circle don't work. Oh. Sorry. I was laying on her tail. Probably didn't feel too good. I mean, she didn't complain, but still can't imagine that was comfortable. <sighs> okay. Geronimo. Oh, damn, that was almost a very far drop. Why did that one hurt? Oh, shit. Oh! Fuck me, that hurt. Oh, shit. Oh. Oh, yeah. Now, is, I wonder if, if that's two, like, actual bullets? Like, two shotgun shells themselves? Or two, like, packs? Well, that was fucking expertly done. Jesus Christ. I feel like I need to use another one now. Oh, yeah. Just saw that. Oh, I wonder if I can shoot through that. Looks like that'll be a no. Fuck me. This is about to get crazy. I can't even get lined up on a goddamn switch, though. Nothing's gonna get crazy until I can flip a switch. Why are you so angry at me, dude? <gasps> okay! That's a surprise. Huh. Pretty funny. Okay, no guns in the water. Bears in here, though. I know that much for sure. Yep. Oops. Oh, fuck. That was bullshit! My god! Whew! Okay. There's another key thing. Ugh, whatever. Fuck. Check this out, I guess.
Actually, yeah, no oops, I didn't even fucking explore bear room all the way. And I'm trying to, like, move on to the next room. No, I need to figure out what the hell is up with the bear room. That shit was dumb, and I didn't like it. Tell me why I'm compelled to order food, even though I literally have a fucking beef roast in my crock pot, fully cooked, ready to eat. I just need to make some noodles really easily to just like pour it over. As a matter of fact, oh nice! I hope that one fucking stays where it's at. Although it looks kind of like it. Uh, might go start the water real quick and then come back. That's better than what I was going to do, which was start the water and then go sit in my chair and smoke weed until it's ready and then eat and smoke weed. That would probably like take an hour, maybe even two hours. Switch. Wait. That might be the switch that I just flipped. Yeah. Yeah, no, we, we'll, we'll leave that down. Did that... Yeah, okay, whatever. That's fine. Okay, um, so have I gone in a circle then? Anything else up here for me? Ready? God. Oh, I thought I was going to land in the water. Um. So, okay, I guess, uh, yeah. Try this way out. See what's over here. Red wall. Nothing. Uh, riveting. Oh, wait. Okay, yeah, keys get consumed. Okay. Oh! Okay, I was I was wondering if there's gonna be like an option to have the music on all the all the time. I wonder what game does. Oh, that's probably to like restart the level. Or like from the last save or something. <laughs> well, I guess I would be remiss if I didn't at least try. The uh, golden idol thing right here. Oh, wait, yeah, no, it's golden idol shaped. It's not even key shaped. Ah. Uh, okay. 
I thought there was something sticking out of my bag. I think that's like a hair tie or like a bun type situation. Okay, well, this way leads somewhere. Let's go check that room. Now that we know, we need to switch to open that. This game's actually pretty fun. I will say. It's, a, it's like very mentally engaging. A lot of like problem solving and deduction and stuff. I don't know how fun it is to watch. But um, after I eat... I'm probably going to come back and maybe play some Crash Bandicoot or Skull Monkeys or something, you know. Something cool. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so I don't think this is a timer switch, but I haven't tried to do this with a timer switch yet, or with a switch that I've confirmed as a timer switch. There's also another direction to go in there that is behind what looks to be a locked door also. It's up here. No, it's just like a... A ceiling light. So fluorescent um, lighting. You know, most Aztec temples had that. Are we, are we exploring Aztec or Mayan? I actually don't remember. I don't actually remember much out of that first cutscene. I'm gonna level with you. Yeah, so... That must have been where I came from. Yeah, looks like this is a whole lot of nada down here. Do you think that water would be that blue, though? Because I think that water would be some gnarly-ass fucking fetid water. Like, that shit's alive, like some living sludge-type shit. Oh, fuck. Uh... Huh. Wait, yeah, that's... That's right, because the door never opened, the platform just dropped out from under me. So, the question is, what the fuck is the point of it all? Oh, I went the wrong way. <laughs> Duh! The point of it all is that's the fucking end of the level, um, comma, go the right way. City of Val... Val... Valbando. What? I don't know. I don't have my glasses on. Alright. 
All right, well, let's go into level three. Let's just see what we get. I'm really glad I have this. I always used to look it in my PS1 collection and just kind of go, eh. I didn't like it when I was a kid, so I won't like it now. What a stupid, like, thought process, am I right? What was that? Oh, damn. Oh shit, what the fuck? They got all cinematic, that was crazy. Oh shit, there's wolfies. Let's see if I can go somewhere and shoot them out. That kind of looks like a safe ledge. What happened? Oh my god, it's the waterfall current. Okay, so I guess I'll have to pop up over here where the wolf is. Fuck. Or maybe right there. Maybe I can get up right there. I would prefer to not... Yeah, okay. Fuck you! Okay, I bet it's like a secret area or something over here. Secret? That's what I want to hear from this game. Oh. That's actually really fun to do. I don't know why, but those, like, wall jump things, corner, cor corner jumps, I don't know, with the slanted, uh, things, really fun. Hello. Which reminds me. Have hit jump. I thought I just hit X and she tried to jump up and grab onto a ledge, but I have my guns out. Yeah. That should have been a part in that thought where it was like, oh, it couldn't have been that because I had my guns out. Oh my god, there's like three of them! You hear the movie out there? <laughs> what are you tripping on, dude? <laughs> we have fun. Wait. 
this weather just yeah. Those. That's one of my favorite maneuvers in like Resident Evil 4 is the quick turnaround. Which I've actually only played that game on um uh, GameCube. And I don't have my GameCube copy. And my sister's giving me a PS3. So I might just get the PS2 version, actually. Because I feel like that would be kind of fun to play. Um, I know it had different unlockable shit. I think that was the one that you could get. Like a, like a gun that would like instantly kill Los Plagas. What is the point of this? Is that just a fucking cave of confusion? Just to fuck with me? There's like nothing down here. Why? Did I just fight those three wolves for nothing? Oh, that's a full-on corpse. Another explorer that came, I guess. Well, he, he died. I don't know if he came. I hope I didn't just make a mistake. Oh shit, what the fuck? You know, the common fucking Peruvian Velociraptor. What the fuck? There's fucking dinosaurs in this game? Is this is this fucking Turok? For the PS1? Jesus Christ, what the It didn't do that much damage to me, somehow. Oh, fuck! Shit, that shit. Oh, whoops. Oh my god! My footsteps are fucking scaring me. I saw something red over there. Oh, fuck. That's the first one I killed. Okay. Wow. Jesus. Okay. You know, I might have gotten into this more if I knew there was fucking dinosaurs in this game. Oh, this isn't good.
A fucking T-Rex? Oh! Leave me alone! Oh my god. Why? Why can't you strafe? You stupid bitch. Oh! What the fuck? <laughs> um, wow. There's a fucking T Rex in this game. Okay. Okay, before we jump in the water, like dumbasses. Going for a big swim. <sighs> See what we can do from up here. See. So that might be the way to go, ideally. But, yeah, I feel like there's something across this little channel. Probably something cool up that way. I feel like they would make something difficult to obtain over there. Make something, put something. Oh my god, I was a little worried about that, not gonna lie. It's going to be a run, jump, grab, right? There's something fucking good over there. Really fucking helps with this fight, I bet. Oh! I was like, oh, did they stay dead? No, they were asleep, and I just woke that one up, damn it. Alright, whatever. Me. 
she wants. Yeah, I don't think there's anything I can do. That way. Maybe that way. That was dumb. I was getting somewhere with that too, damn it. At least I felt like I was. I, I don't know where this leads. Hopefully back up to the top where I can... Give me two moments. This is a paragraph. If I get a call about my test being negative, I can just come over, right? Told her I'd help her get her tolerance back. She hasn't been smoking since she wasn't feeling well, but we both, oops, wrong button. We were both kind of leaning towards that it might be the flu. And still gonna play it safe. Still gonna wait until you know she hears from the doctor and everything. But, uh, that is really good to be. She's doing a lot better. Oops, wrong button. This one. Oh. 
I'm going to try this T-Rex one more time, and then I'm going to put up the BRB screen and uh, go start my... I, I have to wash the pan. It's... Strong enough. I made strong enough to it. Just finished the leftovers off. Oh, what the fuck? No! Whatever. <laughs> that was rad. It does kind of beg the question, though. What is this place for? Wonder if there's anything behind the waterfall. Which is, I don't know, I feel like a common place to hide things in video games. <laughs> uh, nope, not here. Not in Tomb Raider. The fuck do you think this is? We're raiding tombs, not waterfalls. Oops. My dad was telling me about some Uzis, and I hope this is where I get the Uzis. I think the Uzis will help me take out the T-Rex. Why is this so hard now, though? Somebody explain that. Huh? I saw there was a Tomb Raider level design thing when I was trying to find my stream category. That's pretty badass. That would be fun. It's a very unique platformer, I think. Oh my fucking god! It's totally not frustrating at all. It's gonna be some. Whoa. What the fuck? Okay. I can't wait to do shit like that in later levels. Do some, like, sick ass wall jump shit. That, that looked really fun. didn't scream that time. It's of getting uh, some good practice doing all these arbitrary fucking movements. Sounds like she has hiccups when she goes up like that. Okay. 
one down out of how many jumps I need to make in succession. Fuck! How did I not hit myself on that last time? Not last time, but I guess the one time that I did it successfully. like a Tomb Raider speedrun or something like that when I eat. Jump from the lower one, I guess. So I just need to do a standing jump and then press X? What? 100% accidental badassery. Ah. Uh, figuring out the limitations there. You know. You know what I'm saying? Alright, I think I got this. I think. It's nice to know that I can just, like, hop back up here, though, and I don't have to, like, full-on restart the level. Okay. 
I still can't believe. <gasps> Whatever. I don't even remember what I was gonna fucking say. Oh. Still can't believe they got this ported on a Game Boy Advance. That's nuts. I mean, the Game Boy Advance was no slouch, but, like, for real? The last PS1 game? One entire fucking CD's worth of data? Oh! Oh, what the hell? I was not gonna make it. Not that I was gonna die, just that I was gonna like fall down the damn waterfall again. Or slide off of a sheer face. Sheer face. I'm gonna call someone man. Actually, I think I was wrong, and I think I need to start the jump from back here, but still do the jump that I was going to do. The run, jump, dive. Yeah! I just needed to start it a little further back. this Like, why won't you interact? God damn it! That's rad. Fuck yes. Okay, cool. So now I'm gonna go this way. I still wanna see if there's other things that I can jump to. Uh, write that down on the list of, of things that I can jump to.
Yeah, there's definitely... Oh, okay. I bet you that's where the save crystal is. What is this? It's missing three gears. Okay. Just to kind of get a confirmed perspective. Yes, okay, this doesn't, uh, in fact, appear to be where the save crystal was. Now, I bet you... Still gonna have to fight that fucking... P-Rex. Why does that sound come in so late? It's so weird. Oh, the shoddy. I see a shoddy right there, I think. Kitchen. <gasps> oh. oh, this one. That's what I'm looking for. Kitchen. Okay, and it seems like those gears are gonna flood this place, or, you know, that place, which I think I can go explore. Gonna see if there's anything else up this way. I don't think there is. I also don't think there's gonna be too much of an issue if I fall into the water. Seems like it would all kind of pull up over there.
Okay. Yep, it's official. I'm gonna go this way. And... This way. So then the water drains through here. I don't know what's going to go on with that. I mean, if I can walk onto it, that means it's not going to be bad, right? I'm trusting in that walk button. Maybe a little, maybe a little more than I should. Is this place? I don't think I can. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I can't reach. So. Okay. Well, I got the shotgun. Which, I mean, honestly, what else do you need to kill a T-Rex? Uh, if you can't kill a T-Rex with a shotgun, come on. Our ancestors were doing that shit with, like, rocks and stuff. Let's, like, be real here, come on. Okay, so, um... most out of that fucking explore tag in my, uh, my twitch tags. Oh, shit. I know where the T-Rex is.
It's this weird doorway carved, or not doorway, but like passageway, hallway, I don't know. Just terminates like this. Exactly, I don't know where I went. Oh, I'm pretty sure, actually, yeah. This is your punishment for missing the jump, right? That you have to fight those three. What am I missing? Where the fuck did I go last time? Oh wait, I remember now. kind of like warning me like hey she's about to go down dude here you're gonna need this why do they treat the camera as a physical fucking object Come on, where are you at? It's good. Cool 
I, I will say I'm, you know, scared. Like he broke the bridge, clearly that's what I think. Like he snapped the bridge. What happened to my shells? No way. Fucking got him. Look at that guy. Jesus Christ. Fucking T Rex. Parts the destroyed bridge. New theory for the dinosaurs. Uh, they were enslaved by the ancient humans, and they're all located within um, monuments, pyramids, and shit. It's like a T Rex in the fucking pyramids. Oh my god. This place is lousy with dinosaurs. Wolves and bears were, you know, a little easy, but god damn. Hold X. Okay, I'm going to save here. I'm going to throw up the BRB. I'm gonna go uh, start my uh, water boiling. Well, this game is getting good, I will say. Motherfucking T Rex. Goddamn raptors and shit. What are they? Or am I gonna fight a tri Triceratops? Oh, fucking giant sloth. 
I don't know what to expect. I didn't I didn't know there were fucking dinosaurs. I didn't Whatever. Sue me.
putting a keyboard on top of my laptop, and I noticed it makes my laptop look really hot. This time I flipped the little feet up on me. Alright, but, yeah, we're back. I'm back. At least, I don't know. Fuck. Anyways, thanks for hanging in there. That water boiled really fast, because my stovetop's a little fucked up. Oh, I don't really remember where I am. I know I just saved. My stovetop's a little fucked up, and... Sometimes it just... Like, fucking goes crazy. And pretends like it needs to be a thousand goddamn degrees. And, um... So I sat down, I took a, a a couple rips off the bong, and I was about to come back in here, and I walked through the hallway, and I was like, wait a minute. Sounds a little, uh, crazy, and I go in there, and the fucking burner's glowing red. Shit's rapid boiling. Okay, fuck yes. <laughs> Oops. Looks like that's kind of it for this little area. That's rad. Got the gear. Yes, let's... Yeah, it looks like that's it. Ah, damn it. I feel like if certain developers would have worked together during this time period, could have been some really rad games. Like if these guys teamed up with the Crash Bandicoot team, imagine what they could have created. What's this? Another safe crystal? Hmm. Ah, the bridge. That's how I do this. Go with. Hmm. I feel like this is gonna be rough. I mean, I guess that's the maximum difficulty of a long jump, you know, but it's those buttons compound. Uh, what's the point of this, though? Is the question that I am asking. This may be... Let's 
so what's the point of this then? Why did I do this? Like, actually, legitimately, what's the point of this? Oh! <sighs> the world I never know. Very weird. And then I don't see anything that I would like, you know, jump out to. Now. I kind of fucked me up. Not a very responsive jump, but it's a very springy jump. I don't remember. I remember going this way, but I don't remember what was over here. Okay, so you can do like a cool infinite wall jump. That's fun. Kinda. Doesn't help. Myself by jumping. Okay, and yeah. this takes me back to. Okay, yeah, what the fuck then? Oh, wait. What? Oh, it's just like a file set chain. Definitely seems like there's something over there. It seems like an important spot, you know?
Wait. Is that a gear? Oh my god! Fucking almost invisible! Stupid! So, okay. How many gears do I have? Okay, pistol, shotgun. One med kit left. And I got two pugs. One more. Now I'll use that safe crystal. <laughs> now, the question is... Starting to put something together here. I got paid. Nice. That's lovely. All right. I guess maybe there's nothing over here. Whatever. That thing could literally be anywhere, and it's very, very. Hard to see sometimes. I don't think four shotgun blasts and a couple of rounds of pistol ammo would fucking take out a T Rex. But I'm no paleontologist. Uh, or adventurer. <laughs> Is this that little fountain pool thing again? <laughs> I feel like I'm running in circles! Yeah, that's, that's what that is. Damn it. So that means 
that way. Set the bridge. Okay, I'm guessing something with that. Maybe. You know what I mean? Water again. Okay, I don't think I've explored that. I don't think I've seen that at all. That's right. point of this, I, yet again, I'm asking myself, why is this here? Okay. That was close. Tile distance. Tile sets all wonky. Maybe I can jump diagonally to that. I think I'm just doing some weird shit that's actually not going to get me anywhere. I think that's where I come from, from one of those from that one that's over there where I killed that so. oh I didn't even see this so waterfalls do sometimes lead to secrets Oh, fuck you! Can you please leave? Thank you. 
fucking hit me hard. Dino buddy leaves. I some in some sort of infinite loop. Mm. At least I killed the fucking thing. Damn. Imagine if I just very quickly got up here. Yeah, that's fine. Like, you don't even really need to jump, just kind of like, you know. Oh. Oh. I might not be hot. I don't need to jump. <laughs> well, I mean, I, I need to jump. I just didn't need to jump. Weird corner. Point of this. Wait, is there a cog? Ha! Fucking a! Look at that, wouldn't you? Fall damage. And I gotta say, I'm curious to know what the fuck's over here. I guess this kind of leads back into the sanctuary. I don't know what I'm talking about. The main chamber. The big hallway chamber.
Huh. Well, I got all the gears, so I guess that means I go back to the beginning, right? Go to the one thing and do the thing. What the fuck is going on? I do remember it being not very easy to get to that part. Hopefully I won't have any issues with it. I got my practice so It's a big ass level. At least I ran this. I like practiced this several times before now. <laughs> Almost forgot the fucking top one. For some reason I was thinking exit jump. But no. Square for this game. Okay. Square. Make sense of that if you can. Oh wait, no, I see her. Pull it from the back there. Huh. 
that looked really weird. Okay, let's see what we've done to our environment. Oh, I gotta do the backwards, I guess. To just hang off the edge. So. Oh, are you fucking kidding me, dude? Now I can hear. Much better. Well, I mean, now I can hear at all. Which is, I guess, much better, yeah. No, no, no tracks. <clears throat> um, okay, so let's just go right in the shotgun. So I guess I probably picked it up with two rounds in it. And then the two that I had already picked up probably also just like automatically stacked onto it. Cool. So we got another treat T-Rex worths. Pretty rad. Uh, I wonder if that means it's time to fight another T-Rex. Level's fucking huge. So I fell from up there. Alright. Oh. Saw a door over there. Wonder if that's to allow the water through again. Damn, I thought I was almost done. I was gonna switch it up to like some Crash Bandicoot or something. But no. If I stop in the middle of this level, I'm gonna be so fucking confused when I try to come back to it. Yep, okay, there's water inside. So that has been confirmed. So, just a thing.
don't know if this has got a point or not. So I could have literally just climbed up to where I am now. No need to do any of that extra work. Oh! What the fuck? Because this is, this is the start, right? Like, what the fuck? How? How? Oh. The water. I literally just jumped back. Okay. So the door's flipped. Okay. I don't like the sounds of that. I feel like I could die very easily. <gasps> okay, but I didn't. And now that there's no more waterfall, there is a thing behind the waterfall. fun. It's very difficult, though. Very, um, I don't know, very mentally engaging, I guess. I'm not gonna play this level. I'm gonna switch to something else. And I, I don't know, Crash, I'm really thinking Crash. Oh my god. Wow. Okay, wow. Well, this is going to be something else. Oh, that's cool. Okay, so I'm going to... Here's one. Here's one. I'm going to put my BRB screen back up. I'm going to go with Drink and Emergency. Because I'm starting to feel some shit in here. A little bit of, like, congestion and some soreness. Probably going to smoke a little bit more hash. Uh, I gotta switch all my tags and stuff in stream, and then I'm gonna pop in some Crash Bandicoot. So, uh, you know what, actually, scratch that. This has been a five hour stream of uh, Tomb Raider, so um, I'm actually just gonna end stream.
and restart stream uh, in a few moments with uh, Crash Bandicoot. Uh, all plugged into the titles and stuff. So, uh, thanks for watching. Uh, I've actually really enjoyed my first time really fucking with Tomb Raider. Uh, so, there will be some more of this in the mix. Woo!